It's Monday, April 25th. My name is Juan Brown. You're watching the Blanco Lirio channel and the Red Bull stunt over Eloy, Arizona went on despite being denied by the FAA to put this stunt on in an effort to gain likes and subscribers on social media via a three-hour Hulu live stream. Resubmit for further disapproval. Here's the letter of denial from the FAA for uh, Luke Aikens, who is seeking except exception from section 91.105. That is, you got to be in the airplane. Somebody's got to be in the airplane flying the aircraft at all times with a safety belt on. And down here it says, uh, the FAA sent a letter to the petitioner requesting information on how granting an exception would be in the public interest. The response and in a subsequent conversation with the FAA on 11 April, the petitioner expressed that he has made media and sponsor commitments regarding this event. Wrong answer, especially in the event of the recent Trevor Jacob fiasco. The, uh, the FAA also denied this request on the basis of 91.113. You can't maintain, see, and avoid if nobody's flying the aircraft. The likelihood of the aircraft striking each other is very high. Also, the FAA has denied similar requests in the past. And finally, the FAA has determined that a grant of exemption is not in the public interest for the proposed operation. Despite being denied by the FAA, these guys went ahead and did the stunt anyways, and that's what's really going to get them in trouble. Willful non-compliance of the regulations. Here on AirNav, we have a brief overview of what happened. So the idea is to fly these two Cessna 182s modified with a huge drag break of about nine times the drag. As soon as they pitch over, they jump out of each other's aircraft to begin to do a plane swap. And in the plane on the left side of the screen, it immediately over pitches and enters an inverted flat spin. Well, that slows the aircraft down considerably. The skydiver cannot slow down to keep up with the aircraft. Once the skydiver has passed that aircraft, there's no hope for recovering that aircraft. It's a goner. But it does look like the other aircraft, the other skydiver was able to do a plane swap and successfully recover the other Cessna 182 right there. So that aircraft was able to be brought back safely. But the aircraft that entered the inverted flat spin, they did pull a tail shoot on that aircraft, but it, I assume it was destroyed in the subsequent crash. And of course that skydiver just pulled his parachute and landed safely. But scratch one perfectly good Cessna 182 in this stunt. Inverted flat spin. Over here on the HNN channel, there's a bit of a description of how they set these aircraft up for these stunts. In addition to the giant drag brake that they built, which is about, like I said, nine times the drag of the overall drag of the aircraft, they also created a autopilot, a crude autopilot system that would attempt to hold the wings level going straight down on these aircraft. Here's your... <laughs> Here's your FAA-approved cocktail napkin sketch of their uh, great idea. But it's this relationship of the center of gravity to the center of pressure and the, and the rot and the point of the speed brake that is so very critical. And in this case, the drag of the speed brake overcame everything else and got the one aircraft to enter an inverted flat spin. Here they are setting up the speed brake and it looks like they've just bolted it right onto the gear legs of the Cessna 182. Here's Luke explaining how it's all gonna work. And Troy. And the uh, engineer, Paolo Iscold. So Luke's going to get a big time out from the FAA, especially for doing this stunt after the FAA told him no. And this is an ongoing disturbing trend in social media to be performing aviation stunts solely for the source of likes and subscriptions, subscribers. 
We've got a lot of young, new, impressionable people coming into aviation that are very reliant on social media to get their information and are very easily influenced on social media by these stunts. The only channel you're going to end up on if you do this is the Blanco Lirio channel. Thanks so much for your support. See you here.